Good day, everybody, and welcome back to a Pete's HQ. Uh, I'm your host, as always, Pete Oz, and welcome back to the Secret of Monkey Island. As you remember last uh, last time, our, our love, the governor, has been taken by the ghost pilot LeChuck. So we need to rally a crew together and sail to Monkey Island to save her. So let's uh, let's do it. So hope everyone's having a great day today uh, let me know down in the comments what you've been up to i'm uh playing some monkey island and uh, i have a delicious delicious cup of coffee Just have, a, have, have a quick drink all right so as you all know obviously um uh, haven't played this game many many times i know where our crew our crew is so uh let's let's go meet the first one Let's go meet Meat Hook, shall we? Alright. So I'm use that quality rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle to get across. Okay, open this door. Here he is. Hey, I don't like visitors. It's not what the sign Who says. You? Um, and the governor's been kidnapped, buddy. That's uh, that's a pretty good reason why I'm here. The governor's been kidnapped. What? That's preposterous. Well, it's oh, really? not. But we have proof. Take a look at this note they left. Oh no! This is horrible. What are we going to do? Um, we get a crew together and sail after them. Sounds good. We could good. get a crew together and sail off after them. What an idea. Now, if we only had a captain. Well, what about me? Ha! You! Ha! 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 Really? Really? Okay, let's see you prove it. Walk this way. There's something in here that I want to show you. Something horrible. Something so horrible that I stay awake at night just thinking about it. But I don't mean to scare you. I'm not scared, Mr. Meathook. I'm sure a big, brave guy like yourself will have no problem facing this monster. Sure After right. all, it's much smaller than the beast that bit off my hands so many years ago. Arr, 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 arr. Let's just hope you're quicker than I was. Oh, I just remembered something. I never did get around to feeding him this week. Ha 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 ha! Silly me! I'll let you open this last door yourself. Just let me get out of your way. Wait. Ha ha ha! Getting cold feet? No, I just don't know what I'm supposed to do. You're supposed to open that little door. And if you're brave enough, touch the beast inside. Oh, is that enough? Okay, go ahead. If you've got the guts. I think we do. I think we do. I think we open the door and we touch the beast inside. Here we go. I don't believe it. You are a brave man after all. You yes, faced yes, I the am. beast I've feared all these years. You had the guts to do what I never could. I feel like such a coward. I'm not good enough to be on your crew. I'm not even good enough to swab your dick. I'm sure you'll be fine at swabbing yeah. dicks. Put a bit of uh, pads oh, on those on, hooks. Mr. You'll be, you'll be fine. Uh, meat hook. Mr. Meat Hook? 
You're a big, strong, good-looking guy with a great tattoo. I can make it talk. Who want to see? Yes, I do. Uh, yes. Maybe later. Anyway, you can swab my decks anytime. <laughs> really? Sure. I can still be on your crew. Just pack your stuff and meet me at the dock. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I won't let you down. Let's well, one hey, down. Maybe I'll get a chance to show you my whole tattoo routine when we're at sea. Wow, this is sounding better and better all the time. I don't know whether you guys can hear those uh, bangs in the background, but uh, there seems to be a whole heap of birds absolutely having a ball of a time on the roof. Okay, use the rubber chicken on cable. There it is. Wow, it works both ways. That's some chicken. <laughs> it really shouldn't work both ways when you think about it. All right, that's uh, one down. We've got uh, two more to go. Where's the path? There it is. <laughs> oh. Meanwhile. Meanwhile. Having just returned from melee, LeChuck and his crew find their old hiding place in the underground rivers of Monkey Island and drop anchor. It's Festa. Captain, sir. I just stopped by to congratulate you on your kidnapping mission. Captain? Captain, are you all right? Never felt better. And how fares our prisoner? Ah, yes, the uh, prisoner. <laughs> we had a little trouble. Trouble! No, 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 nothing to worry about, sir. Everything's under control. She escaped a few times, but we've got her locked up in the brig. No one's getting in or out of there. For your sake, I hope not. With years of planning almost destroyed by my death, I'm not taking any chances now. Yeah, death at destroy your plans, that's for sure. You took care of Mr. Threepwood then? Guy Brush Threepwood will not be a problem. Sorry, he thinks. At this very moment, he's 20 feet underwater. Probably bloated up like a fattened pig. His eyes being eaten out by crabs. Fish pecking at his fingers. Kinda makes you wish you were there to watch. Ah, yes, sir. <laughs> sure does it that. Now. Go check on the route. Make sure it's locked up tight. Aye, aye, Captain. Okay, so we need to get a third person. Or oh, second person, sorry. Um, so we're going to go give our old friend Carla the Swordmaster a visit. So let's, let's go. the forest let's, uh, let's talk to the sword master probably not gonna be happy to see us you've already got the t-shirt what do you want now <laughs> I'll embarrass you with sword fighting again <laughs> The governor's been kidnapped. What? That's ridiculous. It's really not. Oh, no. This looks bad. Very bad. I'm getting a ship and a crew together to go rescue her. Hmm. I have a feeling I'm going to regret this, but count me in. I'll meet you at the dock. Well, she was easy. So it was it was very little convincing there. So uh, she's done. There is one more person we have to spring out uh, spring out of jail. That's it. Uh, we're gonna go talk to our uh, 
old friend the Rat Eater Otis. So, uh, let's, uh, let's go. Oop, to the village. still be packing because they're not at the docks. Just left the scum bar door open. Probably me. I was spending hours as a kid trying to recruit this bloke and the uh, and the other guys. These are uh, these blokes. Alright, here we go. Let's go let's go get him. I want it. May I help you? Um, yeah. I was just on my way to the governor's mansion. Are you here for the looting? The looting? Uh, yes. Yes. Looting sounds like fun now that I'm a pirate and all. And do you have reservations, sir? Why, yes, I do have reservations. I do. And what name would they be under? Uh... It's probably under S for Shine Top. <laughs> nice try, but we're booked solid for the next five hours. Mm, but I might be able to squeeze you in around the two o'clock hour. Would that be okay? <laughs> that sounds uh, that sounds yes, perfect. That would be fine. Super. I'll put you down for one to loot the governor's mansion at two thirty. I mean, we've basically already done it. We stole her idol, so. All right, Otis. Yeah. The governor's been kidnapped. What? Show him the note. Here, look at this note. They kidnapped the governor. That's what I just said. That really makes me mad. Well, come on, oh, let's I go. I feel like kicking someone. Hmm. I wonder if she left her place unlocked. Now they're um. You need not reservations for that one. If I let you out, would you join my crew? Sure. Of course. To my emancipator, I shall be eternally indebted. Until then, I pace. All right. So we've got to we've got to let him out. So. Basically, what we do is uh, we go back to the scum bar. So, and uh, collect ourselves some cups. All right, archway. Open the door. Oh, we don't need to open the door. We can walk to the door. Like, the door is already open. Alright, so we need to pick these up. Pick up mug. Pick up another mug. He's going to come in extremely handy in the next few minutes. Pick up that one. Pick up mug. Right, what's, he, what's he babbling about? So, uh, what's wrong, old son? The governor is gone. Oh, yes. LeChuck and his spectral crew came and got her. They put her in the ghost ship and spirited her away. That's a lot of ghost puns. She was so good to me. Always conveniently losing those health board reports. For a small consideration, of course. Of course. What'll become of my business? Oh, woe is me. <laughs> what can I do to save her? I guess he can himself. You must get a ship and go after her. The ghost pirate's lair is on Monkey Island. Everybody knows that. We're, we're well, getting a crew. Now. All you need to do is find a way there. Uh, I mean, will he's, you join me? He's not the one, but. Uh, alas, I cannot go to see an old war injury. I'm sure you understand. Where can I get a ship? We need a ship. Why, it's Smiling Stan's used shipyard. Same as everybody else. Tell them I sent you. We're old friends. Right. I'm off. Let's go. Good All luck. Right. Let's get a bust artist out. Be sure to wear your mittens. And your galoshes. 
And don't forget to write. Bye now. I don't even know what galoshes are, to be honest. <laughs> okay. So, what we have to do is... I need to... Use a mug. A barrel. This stuff is eating right through the mug. And quickly, quickly, quickly. <laughs> Keep going, keep going, keep going. It's melting, but what we'll do is here, we'll go... We'll use... The mug with another mug, and we'll pour it in. Alright, still pretty good. Solid now. Maybe this has been a, a bit more stressful in the, uh, in the original... In the original game. Alright, so we're gonna use, alright, use. Melting mug with luck. Let's pour, hey, pour the grog drink. over it. A drink! I'm real thirsty. Yikes! Wow! And to think I used to drink that stuff. Super convenient that I'm drinking Hungry. coffee. That's about as strong as paint thinner. Oh yeah, <laughs> thanks. During this during this bit. Sucker! <laughs> <laughs> but do we still have a deal? I'm sure he'll be back. Yeah, he'll be there. He gave me his word as a pirate. All right, so we need a ship, boys and girls. Uh, let's uh, let's go let's go get one. So let's go to Stan's used ship emporium, shall we? Plenty of ships around, but uh, we gotta we gotta buy one. We can't just can't, can't just commandeer one. Which, you know, that would be nice. Uh, lookout still in place. Yeah, fat lot of luck he actually did. All right, let's go to the uh, the only lights we haven't actually explored yet, which are uh, down here. I'm Stan of Stan's previously owned vessels, <laughs> and I'd stand on my head to make you a deal. What sort of craft are you looking for? Big, fast, slow. You want it, I got it. And if I don't got it, I'll get it. I want to make you a deal that you're happy with. <laughs> Because if you're not happy, I'm not happy. But I know you're going to leave here happy today. How do I know? Just look at all these ships. I've got something for everyone. Come, take a and look at There are a lot of ships here, Stan. So Stan actually reminds me of a guy I work with. I work with quite a few salesmen so at work. And uh, Stan... What are you interested in looking at today? Stan reminds me of, uh, of, of one I, I work with. This bloke would literally sell ice to, to Eskimos that have a truck full of ice. Um, what do we What do we want? I mean, not something so, not too yeah. expensive, but built to last. Affordable quality. Hey, that's my motto. I've got just the boat for you. Walk this way. Let's go. Now I can see you're a no frills kind of guy, but I can also tell that quality means a lot to you. It does. I yep. mean, just look at the way you dress. Rugged, like this baby. She comes from a land far to the north, where the sea is as unforgiving as the men are tough, and hey, you wouldn't happen to be from there, would you? You just seem to have a sort of Nordic quality about you. Anyway, we're talking about a real value here. How much would you like to spend? Oh, um, how much am I? Uh, how much am I going to spend? Yeah, money is no object. Well, it is with me. How much you got? 
We get it on credit? Actually, I was hoping to get one on credit. Sorry, kid. Neither a borrower nor a lender be. That's just old Stan's philosophy. If you've got a job, the storekeeper in town might extend you some credit. Then we'd have something to talk about. Unless, of course, you've already got some other means of financing. On second thought, this may not Wait, be you go visit the shopkeeper. Okay, but I tell you, I got a feeling you're going to leave here today with a new previously owned vessel. So, what else can I show you? Actually, I'd like to go think about it some more. Sure, sure, think it over. I don't want you to feel pressured or anything. <laughs> Says the salesman. Right now, I forgot to give you my card. And here's something else to remember me by. A compass? An extra strong magnetic compass. With your picture on it. That's right. It always points directly back here. So if you're what a looking useless for compass. a good deal, you know where to go. I'll be right here when you come back. But I can't guarantee that any of these ships will. Right. They're moving fast today. Yes, sirree. Can't hardly keep anything in stock. He'll be back. All right, I will bring you all back uh, when we are at the shopkeeper. All right, everyone, we are back. We are outside the, the shop. Uh, this is probably, for me, the, uh, honestly, the toughest part of the game. Um, just getting uh, getting it right, so you'll, you'll, you'll see soon. I've got my eye on you, boy. Steal anything and I break your legs. That's a bit harsh, What buddy. do you want? Alright. I'm interested in procuring a note of credit. You are, I uh, you got a job. Uh of course I have a job. Yes, of course I do. Alright. I'll get one of my notes and we'll fill it out. Alright, so you gotta take note of the uh the safe combination. That's that's, that's literally what you have to do. Running it down helps. Let's see here. What did you say your occupation was? I'm waiting tables at the scum bar. Yep, that'll do. Yeah, and I'm the Queen of England. <laughs> yeah, the cook over there waits all his own tables. He likes to spit on all his customers personally. <laughs> what an asshole. <laughs> all right. This is the uh, last time we'll see it. I love the trumpets. What else do you want? Um, can you bugger off for a few minutes so I can rob you? I'm looking for the Swordmaster of Melee Island. Look, I told you she doesn't want to see you. Just, just ask really nicely. Maybe if you asked her again? You can help her pack, because hmm. she's coming. I guess I could hike all the way over there again. Be right back. And don't touch anything! Okay. Let's, uh... Let's do this, shall we? This, this, this may take us a couple of, uh, a couple of turns. So let's push, push and pull. So let's push his... No, that's you. Let's talk to pull. Pull. Yeah, I've already done that. Pull. Let's push. Bear with me, everyone. All right, S and Y. So S and Y. So pull, you would imagine, is towards you. And push is away from you. It's the, uh, that's the theory we're going with. With the... With it. Pull. So it's... Pull. 
Yep. Yeah. Pull. I think it's push the whole way around. Alright. And then push. Damn it. We got it wrong. I knew we would. Actually have it. I actually recorded it on my phone. <laughs> that's, that's what I did. We always used to write it down when I was a kid. Actually, to be honest, I used to get my mum to do this part. But uh, she's she's not here today, so uh, it's it's just me. It's a pull. Pull. All the way around. Push. 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 Alright. Pull. Pull. Push. Push. Yes. There's nothing in here but this note. Great success. <laughs> Done. We've got it. Let's get out of here. Robbed. Robbed. Robbed the shop in town. Let's go get ourselves a boat. Alright everyone, I will bring you back when we are uh, where it stands. So, uh, see you all in a bit. Okay everybody, uh, we are just outside Stan's used ship emporium. So, uh, let's go buy ourselves a boat with stolen credit, shall we? Howdy! Great to see you again. I knew you'd come back. Everybody does. You know why they come back? Just look at all these ships. So what we want is we want a cheap boat. That's, that's, that's for that's everyone. Come, take a look around. So we want we want so the one in the back. What else can I show you? All right. Um, what do we got? I don't really have that much to spend. Have no fear. Every ship I sell is a bargain. Even the as is looking for a real steal. I've got just the boat for you. Walk this way. All right, let's do it. This here is the famous Sea Monkey, the only ship ever to make it to Monkey Island and come back with anyone aboard left alive. Or should I say anything? You see, the previous owners of the ship were two adventurous pirates. They set off, like many before, to find the legendary secret of Monkey Island. And like many before, they disappeared forever. Their fate? A mystery. Almost as mysterious as how this ship returned to Melee Island without a single human aboard. That's a big mystery. Some claim it was sailed back by a crew of chimps. Chimps? There aren't any chimps in the Caribbean. Oh, shut up. It makes a good story. <laughs> anyway, this baby's mine now. That is, until someone makes me an offer. How much would you like to spend? I got credit from the storekeeper. Will you take it? Hey, of course. Your credit's always good at stands. It doesn't matter if you've had credit problems in the past. Divorce, chronic gambling mishaps. I mean, who am I to judge, right? If the storekeeper trusts you enough to give you a letter of credit, he really does trust me. Then you must be an <laughs> honest man with a steady income. You know it, Stan. Uh, right. Let's get down to brass tack, shall we? Let's do it. I know you want it. You know you want it, and I know that you know that I want to sell it, so... Alright. Uh, I'd like to make you an offer. Let's make him an offer, shall we? Straight off the bat. Great. Let's just do it. How much? Let's get it. Okay, okay. 4,000 pieces of eight. Sure, I guess we can start out at the bottom. Well, that's always a good spot to start. All day. 
I'm going to be getting a whole new shipment next week. So you got me over a barrel. I've got to sell this baby, even if it means losing my shirt. Uh, let's talk extras, Stan. Let's talk extras. Extras? You want to talk extras? Great! This baby's loaded with extras. For instance, did I tell you about the porthole defogger? Sound a bit uh, unnecessary. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Okay, but don't blame me if you run into an iceberg or something. It's definitely not the Titanic, wait, and it's the Caribbean. There's more. Did I tell you about the anti-lock anchor? Don't, can't say I need that. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. So we've got to run through the extras a few sure, times, which which knocks the, the price wind. down. But wait, so. there's more. Did I tell you about the rack and pinion rudder? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Well, I guess it'll float without it. Barely. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the velour sail covers? I don't really need them. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Hey, travel light. I can understand that, sure. Of course, mutiny is an ugly word. <laughs> But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the tachometer? I mean, that does sound useful, but we don't need it. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Wow, does your wife know you're such a cheapskate? Yep. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the elevator made with wood from burgundy wine casks? I mean, that does sound good. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Yeah, I guess that is kind of decadent, isn't it? But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about this simulated wood siding? Well, we need that. It's made out of wood. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Okay, but I'm telling you, barnacles hate simulated wood. But wait, there's more. Right, Did I tell you about the porthole default? All right, so he's starting to repeat himself. So uh, about extras already. Let's try and sting him down a little bit. Okay, where were we? So how much does he think it's worth? Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sell this puppy away today for just seventy-three hundred pieces of eight. No. How does that sound to you? No. No. Forget it. I don't need this boat anyway. Now, wait a second. Don't go away mad. I'm sure we can work something out. Sorry, Stan. I'm out of here. Sure, sure. Think it over. I don't want you to feel pressured or anything. Bye now. Did I already give you my card? Here. I'd better give you another one, just in case. Thanks. All right, let's, uh, let's go back, shall we? I just knew you'd be back. I knew you wouldn't be able to get that little beauty out of your mind. Come on, let's go take another look at her. Let's do, Stan, let's do. Let's get down to brass tacks, shall we? Just tell me, what would it take to get you to sail this ship away today? Now you tell me what do you think it's worth, Stan. Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sail this puppy away today for just 6,300 pieces of eight. How does that sound to you? All right, get some extras, shall we? Let's talk extras. Or not get some extras. Did I tell the, you uh, about the porthole right. defoggers? No. I think I can live without that. Two or three extras. Okay, but don't blame me if you run into an iceberg or something. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the anti-lock anchor? No. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Sure, throw. All right, let's leave again. Or at least try and leave this but time. Wait. There's more. Did I tell you about the rack and pinion rudder? Enough about extras already. 
Alright, let's okay, ask him how much he thinks it's worth. Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sell this puppy Still away on 63, today so. for just 6,300 pieces of eight. How does that sound to you? Uh, no. Forget it. I don't need this boat anyway. Now, wait a second. Don't go away mad. I'm sure we can work something out. Well, maybe you're right. Of course I am. Now, where were we? Oh, yeah. You realize, don't you, that they just don't make them like this anymore? <laughs> Let's talk extra. Well, how do they make them, Sam? <laughs> did I tell you about the rack and pinion rudder? You did. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Well, I guess it'll float without it. Barely. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you oh, about the velour sail covers? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Hey, travel light. I can understand that, sure. Right, let's leave again. Of course, mutiny is an Actually, we'll ask him how much he thinks it's worth. But then, wait, uh, there's wait. more. It's, Did it's I tell high. you about the taco meter? Enough about extras already. Okay, where were we? Okay. Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sell this puppy away hey, today buy that. for just 5,800 pieces of eight. How I'll make him an offer. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. Here we go. How much? All right, 5,000, but that's my final offer. 5,000 pieces of eight? Okay, okay. Burn. It's the sea monkey is ours. Okay. And I thought I was going to give my children Christmas presents this year. Just oh, you'll be right, Stan. You have a new shipment coming in next week. You just I'm told us. I'm glad to get rid of it. Oh, yeah. Do you have that note from the storekeeper on you? Uh, yes, I do. Thanks. I've got to run these numbers by my boss. He'll think I'm nuts, but I'll talk him into it. You meet me at the dock with your crew. I'll bring the ship and the papers. Sounds like a plan. I just want to say that I really feel like we got to know each other today. I mean, I really felt some bonding here. And I don't just say that to everybody. It's <laughs> been great doing business with you. Really? Sucker. See you at the dock and <laughs> don't forget your crew. All three of them. Yes, yes, I've already got them. I've already got my crew. Thank you for letting me know, though. All right, let's go to the dock, shall we? What does the sign say? It's, uh, it's a movie sign. I sold the ship. Can you believe it? <laughs> I'm off on a long vacation spending some poor sucker's money. Arrivederci, baby. Stan. <laughs> that's, uh, that's good. All right, to the uh, lookout point. Nah, village. Let's go, village. And here he is, and here is our beautiful, beautiful ship. Hey, it's a good thing you showed up. Ten people have offered to buy this baby off me while I've been standing. Well, I doubt it, Stan. I haven't seen anyone since uh, I saw I the said, uh, ghost no ship. Way. I know a guy who's in love with this ship, and it would break his heart to lose it. Am I right? Of course well, I am. Wouldn't say I mean, just look at her. Sleek, aerodynamic, a buoyant barnacle-covered beauty. Yep, the ship. I think we're having a real moment here. <laughs> I've changed my mind. I can't give her up. You can have your money back. How could I sell something so dear? Then again, a deal's a deal, right? <laughs> right. <laughs> Good luck, yeah. I'm out of here. Whoops, I almost forgot to give you this free seafaring literature. My gift to you. Just remember where you got it. Stands! 
Excellent. Maybe I should have gotten that extended warranty after all. Hey, long time no see. About five minutes, but sure. Otis, I thought I'd never see you again. Hey, I could never pass up a chance to make some easy money. Uh, money? Yeah, we are getting paid for this, right? Uh, sure. Sure. Is it true what I heard about you and the storekeeper? <laughs> Look, don't start with me, okay? So what's that waterlogged wreck doing out there? How are we going to get our ship in here with that pile of scrap in the way? Where's the cabin boy? Well, I need him to go back to my place and pick up my bags. What's going on here? Where's our ship? Where's our crew? This isn't going to be as easy as I thought. <laughs> Part two, the journey. Through the courageous leadership of Captain Freep, uh, Threepwood, the Sea Monkey is finally underway. Undaunted by their lack of navigational equipment or expertise, the crew begins to plan their voyage. First of all, I'd like to say it's great to be working with such a fine crew. The voyage ahead is not going to be easy. It's going to take skill, endurance, and most of all, teamwork. First, I thought we'd assign some duties. What is it we were suckered into doing again? <laughs> Gotta rescue the governor, boys and girls. I list. Suckered is right. I don't see what the big deal is with rescuing the governor. She can clearly take care of herself. The way I look at it, we got this great ship. Well, we got a ship. Why don't we kick back, tie a rope to the wheel, and cruise for a while? I could use a little work on my tan. Come to think of it, I have been a little stressed out lately. I could use a rest. Then it's decided. We cruise the Caribbean. It's really not the plan, guys. Uh, I'm doomed. Well, everybody, that is where we're going to end today's episode. Uh, we are aboard the Sea Monkey, and we are on our way to Monkey Island to rescue the governor. Thank you all for watching. Uh, please don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. See you all on the next one. Thank you. Bye.